little children i hope you all are enjoying and staying safe at home as we are away from school our knowledge to learn something more grows so today in my session i am going to teach you about parts of a plant as we move parts of a plant i have already put on the board prior to my session i have prepared a small drawing for you and i'm going to teach you various parts of the plant as we all know when we sow a seed in the ground or when a fruit falls on the ground a small baby plant grows so when a baby plant grows it grows into various parts today we are going to learn what are those various parts of the plant now as you see here these are called roots roots are under the soil now roots take water from the ground and supply it to various parts of the plant which help it to grow now the root also holds the stem this part of the plant is known as the stem the roots under the soil supply water and holds the stem to stay strong on the ground it does not help it to move or break once the stem becomes stronger slowly it starts growing now this part of the plant that you see it's called a bud from a bud a flower grows now this is called as a fruit a fruit has many or one seed in it now this part of the plant i i'm sure you must have seen it is known as the leaf leaf is also known as the kitchen of the plant it is known as kitchen of the plant because it prepares food for the plant with the help of the food the plant grows now as we move forward this is a flower a flower which grows from a bud so now as we have learned the various parts of the plant and what are the importance now a quick recap the parts which are under the ground they are known as roots roots take water from the ground and supply it to various parts of the plant now about the soil the stem which holds firm on the ground now this is a bud from a bud a flower grows now a fruit a fruit has one or many seeds in it leaf leaf is also known as kitchen of the plant because it prepares food for the plant which helps it to grow now as we all know this is the flower flower which we all like now here children i am going to show you a sample of a live plant now if you know we all find this in our kitchen this is known as coriander leaves now as you see here for example coriander leaves this part of the coriander leaves are the roots now this is also known as herb it is not a tree or a shrub because it grows very small in size now these parts of the coriander is known as roots which will be under the ground now this root takes water from the ground and supplies to the plant now these are the leaves which are used as vegetable to give flavor to our food now children as you are staying at home and we use our hands for many various things to do we read we write we eat we play we touch phone we play with the remote we watch videos so whenever you touch various things at home i would request all of you to take your hand sanitizer put few droplets on your hand and to sanitize your hands every 20 minutes before or after you touch something so that the fingers that you have will be safe because we use our little fingers to do many other activities like writing drawing coloring so it's better to keep your hands safe and clean wash your hands every 20 minutes or sanitize them stay safe hope to see you in my next video bye